the rest of the support material out. So here I'll just take a little X-Acto blade, I can fit it down into that slot and pull out that support. So if you're going between these four parts, you can tell there's definitely slightly different qualities of each one, and they were printed with slightly different settings. Perhaps this one had two extrusions and a little bit of gap fill. Now you could adjust that to be just two smooth extrusions and get that smooth wall there without any artifacting or ghosting. Or you could go and actually design the part to be a specific width so that wouldn't happen in the first place. And that comes down to design for additive manufacturing or DFAM, D-F-A-M. Really, really important in addition to knowing your machinery and how it behaves with different materials. The rheology and how the liquid molten polymers flow is different for everything. So just know before you get into this that each part's gonna have multiple correct answers for how you tune it, but it's gonna depend on how you like it or need it for your application. And there we have it, our Ultim 1010 Space Grade part that is actually in service.